This is my my office here in Las Vegas. Got some stuff hung up. Cartoon of Greg the Hammer Valentine. I don't know what that, it's come off some video game. Me and Jimmy Hart. And here's my Pro Wrestling Hall of Fame stuff. Pro Wrestling Illustrated. Call for Alley Club out here. Hall of Fame of the United States. This is when I went to uh, Afghanistan. And Jimmy Hart, I was with Jimmy Hart we were for three weeks. I was scared to death. The fighting was still going on. So they gave me the pink heart. <laughs> so, yeah. My figures, my Hall of Fame plot. Um, here's my new figure right here. This just came out. It's awesome. Uh, up here. This is brand new, huh? Yeah, that they've only been out that because of COVID they were you know they were gonna come out last year but now they're just coming out. But they're still hard to find. This is great and this is your old Hasbro figure? Yeah uh, yeah and over here a couple of Hasbro's this is the very first my very first one the LGN? LGN. And this is, uh, what's it called? Um, they're out They're out here in California. Uh, Jack, Jack Pacific. This was, you know, this was a great, great one. One of, my, one of my favorites. And then of course the Hasbro, this one, was a thing that goes like, you know, maybe it used to, <laughs> it doesn't do that anymore. <laughs> This guy wants to fall on his face like I used to do out there. And here's a smaller version. Um, some of my magazine covers. Uh, Johnny Valentine, my dad, there's a Mid-Atlantic heavyweight belt up there. That's the original. Uh, this here is one of my favorite uh, covers. Because I, it says Greg Valentine is the right WWF champion because they held the belt up. And me and Tito, me and Rick, the Valentine Flair Wars, Wars, me out here in Vegas. There's the Intercontinental Heavyweight Title. That's a replica, but it's a good, good shape and expensive replica. And. Uh, my wife sent that to me. I love you, Valentine. Another one of my cover shots. I had a lot of cover shots, you know. Bill Apton took good care of me. I love this office back here. I didn't even want to do this. My wife, she wanted me to have a nice office, and it's, it's getting nicer. I do a lot of Zoom calls. I do a lot of uh, uh, cameos. You know, I got a lot of good stories, a lot of funny stuff, you know. I'm a comedian too, so me and Honky, me and Honky did some comedy shows, about three of them. And eventually I want to do some more, either by myself or with Brutus. Um, I think Brutus is, is a hell of a funny guy. So, Jacob Snake's done a lot of that stuff. Here's my sun bed. People say that I spray my tan on. Nope, I just lay in here. It's an awesome. My wife made our beach room. We lived forever in Florida, so we brought a little bit of Florida with us. Come over here and get this. This is a, our wedding 25 years ago. And uh, and there's Julie's father and Bruce's wife, and there's myself, and there's Bruce Beefcake. He was my best man. Johnny Green, one of the local friends. And my wife, big time jet skier. Here's a jet skier picture. Great shots. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, I want to show you one more thing. I don't know if you got it. This thing right here. This is an old Houston. Could you be in from Houston? Yes, yes. This is. Uh, Sam Houston Coliseum. Johnny Valentine against uh, Austin. Uh, 
Yukon Eric, what, who is it? Yukon Eric, I'm sorry. Or Buddy Austin. Okay, whatever. They were in the main event. Valentine from Sam Houston Coliseum, 19, around 67. Paul Bosch was the promoter. The legendary Houston promoter. Huh? Yeah, Channel 11 he was on, so yeah, definitely. Great Fantastic. guy, Paul. He would actually pay you what you're worth. He'd give you a good payday. And my dad, Johnny Valentine, made him a lot of money, and he would tell you that. 